Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today is August 14, 2015. It is a Thank God is First Friday video. I am so tired. I'm not even going to pull this hat off. You probably can't see it anyway because I'm on my cell phone, so the lighting kind of sucks. I'm tired. I just got in. Me and Nehemiah, we've been running errands since 9 something this morning. We went to a lot of places and we are just now getting back in the house I have all this nail polish on my nails because I've been I was trying to see what color I wanted for my toes and I didn't used to like like nail polish on my feet because I really didn't like my feet but I've come to um, have a better relationship with my feet so I every two weeks I try to give myself a pedicure um, sometime I'm just too busy so tonight or tomorrow or yeah tonight or tomorrow I'm gonna get that in and so um, this is the color that I chose of course thank you son for bringing that in there look what he just brought in here this long bag it's a heavy bag I'll show you guys but this is the color you probably really can't see the true color um, and then I got a filer because, a nail filer because I don't have one. So if I want to do pedicures more often, then I got to get the stuff that I need. So I thought this was really cute. And then I got some shampoo and conditioner for my hair because I was running out. And I have this thing called a soft curl. And my hair is just like super, no, you're going to spill that. My hair is like super dry all the time and so natural wasn't really helping me because it was breaking off a lot my hair was long i like finally got it long and it broke off a whole lot because i just couldn't figure out which regimen to get with and it's just too much so i got a soft curl so i got a shampoo and conditioner and these are motions and they smell really good so i'm gonna try these ones out i've had motion products before but they changed the look says new and improved so we'll see how that goes um and then i i normally use wave nouveau but i'm gonna try this um carefree stuff because my grandma has it and i like hers i tried hers when i was back at home so i'm gonna see how it how it does for me so i can get out of this marley hair bun and get my curls back and yes and i'm tired and then this is a bag full of like um perf well uh work clothes that i got from this wonderful place called dress for success you guys if you have not heard of dress for success google them check them out see if they have one in your in your um area they're absolutely wonderful and i want to do a video on them alone and all the things that i got from them for free um maybe like a work professional attire haul something like that but i have some good news for you guys i was working last week from tuesday to saturday um at the mgm for a convention that they had it was an amazing convention i met so many people from all over alaska canada arizona dallas texas back at home oakland um richmond uh puerto rico it was just it was phenomenal and i enjoyed it and i love being able to interact with the people i also got to share some um of my business cards and flyers um go get apparel www.gogeta.com so i was really excited about that um and come next week monday tuesday and wednesday i will be working the magic show it's a huge convention where a lot of exhibitors get together and it's really good. I, I've i always been told I need to get there with my clothing line, but I haven't felt like I've built it up enough or have enough inventory right now to really go out there because it's like thousands of people and I want to be able to provide with um, them with what it is they're looking for. So I just don't want to go and do it half, you know, half decent. I want to do it, you know, all the way. So I'm really glad I get to be there and um, network with some people and see what I can see and uh, meet who I can meet. And, um, oh, and so on the 20th of next week, 
I will be starting a long-term position with the school district and I'm very excited. Um, it's a temp to hire position. Who wouldn't want to hire me full time? So, you know, that's that's a no brainer. I'm very excited about that. Um, it's with the Clark County School District. Um, I'll be registering students, um, I believe, for free lunches. So for those who want to, you know, receive the free lunches, I'll be registering them. It's like data entry, getting them in the system for that. Um, so I'm excited about that. And things have just been like really discouraging when it comes to the job search um you know and applying and knowing that you're qualified and not getting calls back or just not even getting the call at all for interviews so i am just so happy i get to relax for a while you know and not worry about this job hunt game and really get to get in a um really get to get in a flow you know like going to work um well taking Nehemiah to school going to work picking him up you know cooking dinner all that stuff like for the pat like last week I was just running on holy ghost power like no lie um today I felt yesterday I felt like that today I'm a little better I'm well rested um I didn't take Nehemiah to school today um so he got to chill with me and run errands with mommy so I so that was good so I got to sleep in a little bit but it is no joke, you guys, um, when you're not only a full-time parent, but, you know, you have a full-time job um, or you are a business owner on the side, you know, or you help or do things for other people. Like, kudos to you guys that's been doing it for years, okay? So I'm about to get in this groove thing and see how it does. Um, yeah, I said that on purpose. Um, what else? I've been volunteering at Nevada Pep, which is an or a wonderful organization. It's um an organization that helps families with children with disabilities, mental illnesses, um, and they provide tons of resources for them and learning um tools and all kind of things. They um have a walk and roll event coming up September 26th I believe yes and they're gonna have runners walkers tons of sponsors it's just an amazing event and the the theme is bullying so bullying teasing rumors nasty words put downs all those things you can think of that have to do with bullying and I am working with them now to hopefully get in and be able to speak a little bit on bullying and teasing because you know um when you have a disability or a mental illness and just even other things when you're just different period whether it be your skin color the way you talk the way you look you know your body your shape whatever you know you often get picked on bully teased you know things of that sort so i love to be able to be a part of that and share um some things to inspire the audience so i've been there Finally, you know, and they're awesome. They're the person that assisted me when I first walked in the door. His name is Havander. So shout out to Havander at Nevada, at Nevada Pep. Um, he, I want to, I'm going to say visually impaired, um, but he, it's a, I know it's something specific, but I don't remember. And he tells me that he can see shadows. So um, he has a cane and, you know, he, when I came in, he greeted me. He called the person I was looking for, you know, pressed the button, let them know I was here. He just showed great hospitality. It was wonderful. And not only that, but he had a physical disability. And I thought that was he was most definitely a go getter, you know, in the workforce. And he's been there for four years, you know, like it'll be five years next year. So that's great. So I had to hook him up with a go get a hat as well as a, a real life go get a wristband. So um, I love seeing stuff like that. Uh, Nehemiah. It encourages me and it inspires me and motivates me, you know, to keep wanting to share, go get apparel, but just keep going myself. It's like, if he can do it, I can do it. If he can do it, you can do it. So, um, yes. And yeah, I just wanted to share with you guys, your girl is working. Um, as well as I am going to start in being mentored. Um, I have, I'm waiting on a mentor and to go through my orientation. So, um. I'm excited about that. Son, it's a six-week process. He it thinks he's slick. It's a six-week, um, six-month process. Give me that. They're not toys. It's soap. I'm trying to take, open the soap. Yes, give me the soap. So, 
It's a six-month process. It's not your soap, Papa. It's not candy. It's not. It's soap to wash your body. What the yeah, wash your body. It's a six-month process. I'm very excited. Um, I see a spider. I'm very excited about that. Um, so that's something else that I'm doing. I've been networking a lot um, regarding, you know, my mentoring as well as um, my speaking. And I'm just excited to see where God is allowing me to go and taking me what doors he's opening and what doors he's closing. Um, I just want to encourage you guys that, you know, in your downtime, in your season of, oh my gosh, where do I go? What do I do? Do not take your eye off God. Do not, you know, leave his feet. Do not leave his sight. Continue to keep reading your word. Um, praying is very important. Prayer changes things. I believe that from the utmost part, bottom of my heart, deepest part, like, is very important. Prayer is powerful. So, that light at the end of the tunnel, it is there, um, and it will come. And now I'm like, okay, it's here. So, you know, I said I was going to come out here, hit the ground running, and I have been since I got here, and it's paying off. And, you know, and it, and it don't stop there. Son, can you, can you stop? It's all in my work stuff. Son. And it does not stop there. It's going to be a time where weeks from now or a month from now, you know, things might shake up. You know, my, my situation might change a little bit. And it's like, oh, my gosh, what do I do? You know, but don't lose momentum. Just keep striving. Keep thriving, most importantly. Um, as Miss Peak says, don't just don't just strive, you know, but thrive. So keep thriving and pushing harder. And, you know, wear things that encourage you, you know, real life, go get a um stay around positive people you know listen to listen to positive things that you know are uplifting and edifying the body of christ most importantly and i do plan on doing a video for my first day of work as well as what i wear to work i do want to do a video for dress for success and i do have something special that i'm working on for you guys um so i won't share to nothing on that um i hope you guys like hello to my new subscribers sorry i've been busy and going but i think about you guys all the time because i'm like i need to put something out for them but i love you guys um stay positive stay encouraged hit me up if you need to um visit www.gogetter.com like share subscribe thumbs up and be blessed Mwah.